Hello, welcome to another video. Today we're gonna do an unboxing, and it actually is an unbox. So yeah, this is from Crystal Canvas Art Designs. Um, yeah, that's their whole name. Crystal Canvas Art Designs. I actually had ordered from them previously, and I liked it so much, I ordered again. So there are three. I, I believe I only got three. <laughs> there should be only three in this. Um, So there is a note, pretty much they're saying, hi Joan, thank you, Amy. So I'm not showing you the note because it has my name on it and my address and you don't need to see my name and address. So they do ship from the US, um, from Elk, Elkton, Maryland, I think it's Maryland, MD is Maryland. I am so horrible. Um, but yeah, there are three diamond paintings in this. Um, and do they are is there okay so they do show what the diamond painting is on the side so let's just choose the random one let me move the others to the side so everything i got was on sale so crystal canvas art designs does like um they do their their diamond paintings do go on sale relatively often and the last time i bought from them it was also on sale um Oops, so everything I bought was $20 or less. Um, and they do have licensed artwork for um, some of their images. Um, everything I got is a licensed artwork from, from an artist, <laughs> obviously. So yeah, this is the toolkit. It's a square boat, tweezers, wax, and a pen. Um, the square boat is like double-sided, um, but yeah, I don't think I'm going to use that, but these are rhinestones. So all of Crystal Canvas art designs, they are, um, using rhinestones. At least I think all of them are. Um, but yeah, here's the, oops, it's upside down. Here's the first image. This is, is it all on screen? Do I have to move you up more? Um, it's this flower it's called this one is called dazzling by robin mead so it's supposed to be a 40 by 50 diamond painting let's see let me move it this way because it's easier so i'm just peeling back the plastic to hopefully lay it flat which doesn't always work i don't know if you realize this but the plastic is not double-sided only one side won't stick to your canvas while the other side will well most of them i don't think i've yeah i don't think i've had any plastic where both sides were not sticky so so yeah it's this is yeah this was on sale at the time of me buying this this was $16.20, which I think is a really good price for a 40 by 50. Um, so yeah, let's see, is it really 40 by 50? So, yep, 40 by almost 50, or it might be 50 if it, it's about, it's a little bit less than 50, but 50 is the closest one. So let me move you down. So I'm not reaching. So there are 28 colors in this. Um, they do use a different code, which is like a crystal crystal code. Um, I do have a conversion chart that I got from a viewer that, and I, I'll put a link to it below in case you want the conversion chart. So it does look like there was a little bit of a weird run here. Do you see this? There's like a... Is it focusing? Will it focus? I don't know if you could tell. There was a little bit of a... ink run here. Do you see it? There's, it's a little black right there. But... And then you could kind of see it also here too. So I don't know, maybe the ink wasn't completely dry at the time of printing this but i mean it's just gonna get covered yeah it's just gonna get covered or maybe i don't know the ink wasn't completely dry um 
but it's just going to get covered by rhinestones, so I don't, I'm not con too concerned about that. So let's look at the drill field here. Mm. Other than where I saw the ink kind of looks like it's doing a, like, a little running, it's just, it looks fine. Some of them, like that Q, might be a little hard to read, but if there's nothing else like that Q, then I think it should be fine. Um, but yeah, here is the first one. It is all rhinestones. Um, so let's see. Let's check first that there are 28 colors. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. These are so pretty, the colors. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 27, and 28. So yeah, look at how really pretty these are. Are, they are rhinestones, so um, sometimes there is a little bit more trash in rhinestones. But from my last one from this, I don't think it was. I don't think it was that bad. I thought the the drill quality was actually relatively good for rhinestones. So yeah, here is a lovely purple. What is this? A black? Is this black? I don't know. It's it's weird. Um, it's a different code, so I'm not so familiar with it. So some orange here with another purple here's some blue look at this it's just like remarkable how many like these are different shades of blue here oh i really like this color i'm really happy i got this one like this one has has my favorite colors which are these like um turquoisey colors my fan is on so it's it's still hot um my fan is on so my see my my plastic is is trying to escape here um so yeah, are these all the same colors? No, 14, 15. No, these are these are these are different colors. Um, but yeah, no, these look really, really pretty here. Um, these are the same color. Yeah, those are two twelves. So some pretty colors here. Ooh, some oranges. Ooh, I like these colors. I'm a big fan of the bright colors. I don't know. It, they're just so much fun to um, diamond paint with. Ooh, this is all number one. So these are are the like clear drills here. So a lot of that one. So yeah, I'm gonna have to like put these up to side in separate piles to make sure that they don't get mixed. Although wait, they do have the code on. Do they have a code on here? Yeah, AM two three two. So it's just after. I'm done recording this. It's like I have all these things lying around. Okay, so there's the first one. Let me move that to the side here. Um, okay, next one. Just randomly chose one. Okay, so this one, this one is taped. So maybe it's a different. Okay, it's taped. little harder to get into. Maybe I should just use my blade. Why am I using my side of my scissors? Because that's just what I have right next to me. Um, okay. Nothing else in there. Okay, so this one is also, it's, a, it's another one, another 40 by 50, I think. Yeah, 40 by 50, yeah. So, same toolkit with the flat boat here, and here it is. It's this, I think they called it, okay, so they called it Colorful Frog, Colorful Frog in the Moonlight by Nick Gustafsson. Gustafsson. So yeah, this is another 40 by 50. Let's move you up so you can see the whole thing. Can you see the whole thing? Nope, not yet more up um so yeah it's this frog here on like a branch of some sort 
Um, I just got this because I liked the, the color. I just thought like an image like this with this much color would look really, really awesome as a diamond painting. Um, and I do like my animal pictures and I especially like my colorful animal pictures. So, oh, 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 oh. I'm really bad at this. Okay. Oh, oh. See, that's the problem with the plastic not being double-sided is one side is not as is will stick to the the glue more than the side that just comes off easily. And it probably doesn't help that I have my fan on. <laughs> so Okay, okay, what am I doing? Okay, so this one was also on sale, and this one was $19. Um, I don't know if it'll be on sale by the time this video gets posted, but they do go on sale relatively often. So, um, and different diamond paintings will go on sale at different times. So yeah, this one, I just thought it was really cute, and I thought it would look really awesome with the colors. So yeah, I don't know if you can see, here's the original image there the frog on the branch so so yeah this has 29 colors it does still have the crystal rhinestone code but the legend is like one of my favorite types which is in numerical and alphabetical order of letters and just a few symbols um the drill field does not look bad i don't see anything that would be a problem Look at that frog up close. So yeah, there is gonna, it looks like there's a good amount of color blocking here, but then uh, this is pretty much confetti. <laughs> but that's fine. So yeah, here's uh, this image here. Um, let's see the drills there's 29 colors in this oh wait did i measure this it's 40 by 50 let's see it is 40 by 50 yeah that looks pretty much 40 by 50 all right oh my fan is blowing yeah Okay, so I'm checking if all of the stuff is here, although I'm pretty sure if I ran out of something and I contacted them, they will um, send me the drills, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, and 29. So yeah, here's some kind of goldish color, yellow, some greens, some purples, some more greens, and this looks blackish. I don't know. It might be black. Um, and then some bluish kind of things. So this, these are some pretty reddish, pinkish colors, some purples some blues. Ooh, these are my favorite kinds of colors. These turquoisey blue um, green colors. So yeah, ooh, and then some pinks. I like the pinks too. So yeah, I if you've never done a full rhinestone, they're very... They're, I, I find them very, very fun, so... <laughs> so, let's see. Last one. Okay, this one is not taped, so. Oh, did I say how much the other one was? It was $19. Okay, this one is a bigger diamond painting. Um, it should be a 40 by 70. So, bigger than normally I would do. Oh, 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 I dropped the toolkit. Oh, this one has like a different toolkit. It's um, the Mosfa tray 
with, which I like much better than that green tray and wax with a squish and pen with a squishy and like a, I don't know, six placer. Um, ooh, and the ba the bags, the drills come in these baggies. Ooh, so maybe, maybe they're, they're doing some, something different. So this, I wonder if this is one of their newer kits then. Um, and if this is how they're, they're going into the future. Cause yeah, my first, the first, um, crystal canvas art designs I got came with this. So I'm going for, this might be one of their newer diamond paintings. So, so here it is. I'm not sure. I'm not going to be able to get the whole thing on screen unless I turn it the other direction. But it's these tulips with a butterfly. So I'm just going to turn it this way um, so you can get the whole thing on the screen. But it's these tulips with a butterfly here. This is called Tulips and Butterfly by Gary Gay. This is a 40 by 70 and this was $20 when I bought it. And it was also on sale, so, um, so I think that's an awesome price for something this size. Okay. So this is, this is like a reason why I'm pondering why some, like, I, I get it, and you're legally licensing the diamond paintings, it will increase the price, but if someone like like if crystal canvas art designs could have legally licensed diamond paintings in it and the regular price isn't even that bad i don't know i feel like why is everyone else so expensive <laughs> um okay so this looks it, this looks like it's printed like really differently than the other um one let me pull you down so um, this does have 35 colors. Okay, so this is a lot more colors. It's still it's still that um, legend with just the numbers and then the letters in alphabetical order, and it looks like there's a couple symbols here. But this is printed differently. It's kind of... So do you see the symbols are printed in um, more white circles here? Which is a plus because it's very easy to read but it also can be a minus because if the circle is too big is you could see the white under the um drill so and especially if you're used to doing like the dark colors and not like caring about the placement so much because you can't tell you will see where the placement is d wrong when they have these white circles, but yeah. So it makes it easy to read, but also it's it's pretty much a guide circle. Uh, <laughs> but it's just a different type of guide circle. So, so yeah, which is weird is the legend is not printed that way. Do you see, like, it's, it still has the color and then it has the letter on it, but, like, if you were going to look for number one, if we could find a number one, okay, let's just go for number four because I can see a four. So four is, in a, or, is orange in the legend here, but it looks like a four in a white circle on the canvas here. Do you see that? So... So I'm like, oh, why is the legend different than the what's printed on the canvas? I kind of wish then they would print the legend with the white circle in, in a square of the color. I don't know. But yeah, no. so this will be way easier to read. Um, I'm just hoping the drills are bigger than the, the circles themselves. Um, but it does kind of make it harder to see the actual picture now because it has all the little white circles. Um, but yeah, they're in these baggies. I am not going to take them out of these baggies because usually putting them back in there is going to be so much harder. I mean, I will do inventory after the video. But yeah, here is the drills um they're all rhinestones 
here so and it still looks like they're doing the rhinestone code and so i figured i'd just show you my last picture from when i got something from crystal canvas art design so you can see what the rhinestone effect looks like so yeah here is just i'm not going to do a real post review um but yeah here is my one that I did for this was the first diamond painting I ordered from Crystal Canvas Art Designs. I enjoyed it so much that after I finished this, I went onto their website and I was like, "Hey, look! There's a whole bunch of things on sale." So I bought things on sale. Oh, and and um, they do have the shipping is free in the U.S. I have no idea if they ship beyond the U.S. and how much it is if they ship outside of the U.S. But I enjoyed this one so much that I went back on their website and I looked for more diamond paintings and then i tried to stop myself from buying more than just the three because when they were all like there was a whole bunch that were just less than twenty dollars it <laughs> i was like trying to stop myself from buying more and so yeah here in case you want to see what a finished one from them looks like so yeah so oh did i say how much this one was this was twenty dollars um, and this was called Tulips and Butterfly by Gary Gay. Um, so yeah, here is the last image. And then here is the frog, if you don't remember. And then here is the flower. So yeah, that's all for today. So thank you for watching and happy time in painting. Bye!